promise three things that every home buyer in Bellingham needs to know when starting their home buying search. Thing number one is be flexible. And I don't mean Om Shanti be flexible. I mean be flexible in your home search. If you have a desire to have a three bedroom, two bathroom house in Barclay with a grotto and a pool and a hot tub and mirrors on the ceilings in the bedroom, you need to prioritize what really means something to you. So yes, you obviously need those mirrors on the bedroom ceiling. Uh, maybe you need two bathrooms, but do you need three bedrooms? Maybe you only need two. You need to sit down with your broker and have a really open and honest conversation about what your needs are and what your wants are. Make two lists and prioritize each of those lists. Bellingham right now is a seller's market. There's currently about 1.3 months of inventory on the market. And what that means is that if no other homes came on the market, it would take us a month and a third to sell everything. Now typically, it's around five months worth of inventory. So this is a little bit different situation. There aren't a ton of homes on the market, but there are a lot of people still buying. So being flexible in your search can help you find something that you will still fall in love with, but might not be that original long shot idea. Step number two, be competitive. And this goes into that low inventory that we currently have and the amount of people that are buying homes. When you find a home that you like, chances are you're not going to be the only person who likes that home. There are probably gonna be two, 10, 20 offers on that same place. So it's time to be competitive. And even if you've never had that competitive fight, if you played dodgeball in grade school for the sheer joy of being hit in the face with a rubber ball, now is the time to turn it on. You've gotta get competitive, you've got to work with your broker to act quickly, swiftly, and make your highest and best offer first. Step number three goes along with being competitive, but it has to do with your pre-approval process. So it's important to get a pre-approval before you even start looking for homes. So pre-approval for a mortgage. It's pretty commonplace that most buyers are doing that now, but what I encourage you to do is go one step beyond that and get full approval through underwriting. So what this means is when you go in for a pre-approval, you may provide some pay stubs, some tax records, information about your assets, but they just do a preliminary check to make sure that yes, once we send it to underwriting, this person will probably be approved. I'm saying go the full way, bring in all your documentation to your lender, have them send you through all the way through underwriting so that when you put an offer down, they know this money is secure, this money is coming from the bank and it only gives you more of that competitive edge to get the home that you want. So there you have it, three things that every home buyer in Bellingham needs to know. If you enjoyed this information and would like more, I suggest clicking the link in the show notes and downloading your very own comprehensive Bellingham Buyer's Guide. This is a comprehensive guide that we put together with nearly 40 pages of detailed information on neighborhoods, the home buying process, and some financing information as well. So I hope you check it out. And remember, my goal is that when you're ready to buy or sell a home in Bellingham, you think of me first. So feel free to reach out to me. My email is also in the show notes. Remember to like and share this video. Thank you so much. We'll see you next time.